as President Joe Biden is preparing to make a historic apology to indigenous people today. He is set to issue a formal presidential apology for atrocities committed by the U.S. government when it ran residential schools for Native American children. The federal government established and supported these schools from 1819 through the 1970s. Children were forcibly removed from their families to attend these schools to assimilate them into white American culture. These children were disconnected from their own cultures and belief systems and denied the right to speak their native languages. According to an investigation run by the Department of the Interior, many endured emotional, sexual and physical abuse and some of them died. The U.S. will be the latest country in the Anglosphere to make an official apology for residential schools. In 2008, then Australian Prime Minister Kevin Rudd issued an apology to the aboriginals on behalf of his country to those survivors. And in 2010, Stephen Harper made a similar apology when he was Canadian Prime Minister.